everybody, this is our special of the team battle on Smash Bros. Ultimate. Today we have Nez, Captain Falcon on the red team, blue team we have Pichu and Mewtwo, on the green team we have Patman and Isabella, on the yellow team we have Joker and Banjo and Kazooie. The stage that you picked for this one is the Mario Brothers stage from the arcade game Mario Brothers, where there's sidesteppers, shell creepers, and the bouncing bees. But for this, however, just to clarify, if you ever wondered why, well, let me reword that. Uh, just to clarify, by, we've already used Nez and Captain Falcon once before in a team battle, and that was back during our Wii U Smackdown. If you know what I'm talking about, be sure to check out that video on the Wii U Smackdown where Nez and Captain Falcon were on the green team, and they won, won their fight together. So, just to clarify, we're not going to keep on using Nez and Captain Falcon all the time. Otherwise, it's going to get really boring, boring and dull. Oh, just to clarify. But, of course, we have two Pokemon on blue. And, of course, we have two DLCs who will be fighting on the yellow. Which is Joker from the Persona series and Banjo and Kazooie from the Banjo-Kazooie series. So, therefore, hope you got your all-you-can-eat buffets ready. Because here we go. Here we go. I played this game before. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for this one, all you're just doing is getting rid of shell, hell crawlers and sidesteppers. You also get the bees too. Yeah, you have to get rid of them as well. I feel all three of them once. Yeah. But the blue one is terrible because they're fast. Yeah, unless you're quick enough. Ooh! Pichu just lost a life, and so did Pac-Man. Mewtwo lost a life. I thought Mewtwo was supposed to be the strongest Pokemon out there. Well, he technically is, but that's only for the TV show. Because mostly, some people just save their Master Ball for him whenever they try to find him. These are, do these are wasted on a... On one of the legendary birds. Sometimes, because there's also the Ultra Ball they use. That's what my brother did to help me find Aikuda. He used the Master Ball Moltres. Oh! Mighty Gingernator's out! And it's smacking Pichu! Well, of course, that wasn't strong enough, but Captain Falcon's going through a lot of punishment. But if I was playing the game, I would use the Master Ball on um, Zapdos. Ooh, Joker missed his final smash. But jeez, Captain Falcon's going through a lot of punishment. And look at his damage score. Huh. Oh, Isabel's doing her things with... Tommy and Timmy. Yeah, and Tom Nook. Is that Pat Miss Battle Smash? Yep. It's like when he's eating the dots. He has <laughs> little. Yep, when babies. he eats the ghosts. <laughs> oh, Captain Falcon's now lost a life after all that punishment he took. Oh. Star Storm incoming! That's Ness. Yeah. There goes Pichu. What's Pichu's phone? Volt Tackle. Same as Pikachu, but it also damages himself. But of course, for all of you who choose Pichu, don't forget that this is also a warning. Pichu who cannot use electric attacks without shocking itself. So that's for all of you to understand, and for why we should be careful with using Pichu. Because Pichu will also hurt himself. And that's easy for the opponents to knock him out. So keep that in mind, viewers. Because if you keep choosing Pichu, then Pichu will get himself hurt, hurt rather than the opponents hurting him. 
and that's painfully bad. He's only little, so he doesn't understand. Yeah, exactly. That's the problem. He evolves by friendship. Yeah. Oh, Captain Falcon's final smash on Pichu! Wham! Pichu's out. I knew Pichu would not even last long. Nope, Pichu's back. Oh, yes? How did he? Restock, thanks to Mewtwo. Oh, they do with teams? Can they help their partner? Yes. There's oh, Mighty Gingonator. There's Benji Kazooie's finger. On Captain Falcon. Wham! Is the Mighty Gingonator good? Yep. Back in Banjo Kazooie at the final boss fight, the Mighty Gingonator is awakened to take down Gruntilda at the top of her tower, sending her to fall to the ground. Oh, I love Isabel. <laughs> Revealing that thing with Tommy and yeah. Mickey. Timmy, Tommy, and Tom Nook. I think his name is Tommy? Timmy? Tommy Timmy? Oh, the Pokemon are out. Thanks to Pac-Man. Oh, now we all have... Oh. Oh, there's the Joker. Fan. No, that was Morgana from the... Oops. <laughs> Sorry, folks. My screen went black because leaving it alone for so long. So, as you may have noticed, the blue team is gone. Now we have left is the red team, the green team, and the yellow team. That's right. Team Pokemon is gone from this fight. Thanks to Pac-Man. One of the old video game characters. Well, technically, Pac-Man's one of the oldest video game characters according to Nintendo records because he and Mr. Game & Watch are both the same age. Mr. Game & Watch came out before me did. Yeah, true. But of course, they're one year older than Mario and Donkey Kong. Yeah, they came out afterwards. Oh, Isabelle's gone. Oh, we don't lost an Animal cro Crossing character. Yep, that was Isabelle who went out. Oh, Captain Falcon's got a final smash. And, this and he's got Joker. He's using his Black Falcon. But Joker's still alive. But Joker didn't have very much smash on. Well, technically it's because of the ceiling. Yeah. Oh, they're at the bottom, so the ceiling covered it. Yeah. Oh, here comes Pac-Man. Doing his crazy... Thing that you may remember from the game. Oh, when net. When he's eating dots and ghosts. Yeah, now Banjo and Kazooie have one life left, including Pac Man, yep. while Red Team is still holding two lives. Can you explain to my viewers where Joker's from? Joker is actually from a series called the Persona series, where they, however, fight for the good of, of greatness by destroying shadows and black hearts. And pac has gone, so the green team is gone. Ooh. And here comes Joker's thing on. Yep, the Phantom Thieves of Hearts on Cat and Falcon. Bam! And we, we have and enough up to yellow and red now. Yep, because Pac-Man's gone. I already said that. Oh, thanks for the recap. Uh -huh. And here comes the Star Storm. Thanks to Nez from the Kid Aquarius series. No, that's Pit, Darpin, Palatina. Nez is from the Earthbound series. Sorry guys, I'm not really good with the video games yet. And Nez is still standing. At least my boyfriend knows about the game because he's games to know where they were from. Yeah, and look at Nez. A little kid's taking a whole ton of punishment from this. And Banjo and Kazooie are gone. So Joker will hand it up or the red team might win. Well, the red team might win because Nez has two lives. How much does Joker have? He's got one life left. Uh-oh. I didn't know Joker had wings. No, that's his persona. Oh. Yep. Oh, and his... wham! Joker's still standing. Because the ceiling. Yep, here it comes. Oh, that was probably a bad mistake. 
a really big mistake. Well, Nez is still alive. Yeah, of course, because that wasn't strong enough to beat him. The Fortfile's Masters are the big thing. Yeah, but technically it's the damage your character takes. That's the problem. Oh. Captain Falcon has tons of damage too, but I think the Joker has a lot of damage. Yeah. But of course for this stage, everyone's just bouncing off the wall, just bouncing off the ceiling and the floor. It was bouncy back in the game. And now it's over. And the winner is Nez and Captain Falcon, and the red team won this battle. Look at, look at Captain Falcon strike. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we won, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But of course, just to recap, if you ever wanted to watch the one time that Nez and Captain Falcon did win their first team battle, Go check out the Wii U Smackdown they starred in. Then you'll see what I'm talking about for that. Yeah. But we won't be using Nez and Captain Falcon on the same team all the time. Otherwise, it'd be dull and boring. But, of course, we hope you enjoyed the show, folks. Because that, of course, was one Smackdown that had us bouncing off the floor and the ceiling. <laughs> if you catch the drift to it all because you're watching the fight. So, therefore... Be sure to like, share, and subscribe if you want to see more, and we'll see you next time. Have a very awesome day. Bye.